So here the number given is 5c dot e in hexadecimal and we have to convert it into binary. So we know that 2 raised to power 4 is equal to 16. So we have the table that has 16 rows and 4 columns. Alright. So first of all we have the number 5. So we will find the number 5 in the table. So where is the number 5 in the table? Here is the number 5. And the binary value of 5 in the table is 0, 1, 0, 1. So we will write 5 as 0, 1, 0, 1. Next we will look at the value of C. So we will find the value of C in the table. Where is the value of C in the table? Here is the value of C in the table. So the binary value of C in the table is 1, 1, 0, 0. That is actually 12. So we will write C as 1100. Zero, zero. Next comes the decimal point. So the decimal point will maintain its position. So it comes here. And the next digit we have is E. So now we will find E in the table. So where is the letter E in the table? Here is the letter E. And we know that E is 14. And the binary value of E is 1. 1 1 0 so we write e as 1 1 1 0 so now we have calculated all the three values of the three digits that are given if we have more digits in the example then we will calculate the binary value of all of the digits so now we have calculated the binary value of these three digits 5 c and e so we will combine them all together to become one number so now we can say that 0101 0, 1 comes from here, 1100 0, 0 comes from here and next we have the decimal point that will maintain its position and 1110 1, comes from here. So now we can say that the number 5c dot e in hexadecimal is equal to 01011100 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, dot 1110 in binary. So this is how we can calculate conversion of hexadecimal number into binary using the floating point number.